Thank you so much for joining me as Gimaged. We'll be testing out Medieval Trader Simulator. This is build your own shop and of course in a medieval mountain village. Buy and sell over 50 different kinds of products, medieval products, magic economics and a range of furnitures and goods in your shop with 100% freedom. All right, thank you Dev Team for sending a copy of this and it's available on Steam. I'll put a link in the description down below and also a link to my Discord too where I'll give out a bunch of copies of these because uh, yeah, they sent me out copies, extra copies. So thank you to the PR guy and of course, yeah, thank you to them too for that. It's a pretty cool, nice little Christmas, early Christmas gift. Very nice. So let's go and do this. Oh, there's my door. Wasn't sure which one that was. All right, go to your shop. That sounds like a plan. Ooh, all right. I'll close up her door. I like the smell of feces in the morning. Oh, this is great. Looks like everybody has something to do. Somewhere to be. A little jacked up. Oh, not so bad. Press M to your map. All right. We'll do that. Daily worker cost minus 20. Wow, all right, expensive, much. And all right, my shop is there, we are there, so... Okay, I don't know where I'm going, but we'll figure it out. Let's follow that guy, the guy with the pickaxe, or the hammer, or what the hell he's doing. It kind of looks like the shop just showing on top, right? Well, they must be going to my store, it's closed. Oops, sorry. Oh, it's open. <laughs> right. Press Q to customize your shop. Or, well, I'll do that. And all right, so we have a workbook, toilet. Oh, that's a nice toilet, man. That That's classy right there. <laughs> and a table. Table two. So this is, I guess, the number two table where you do uh, the toilets is for your number two. Also, the worker will handle and sell process. Okay, just like the other games, All right? Cool. Okay, so I don't know. Whoa! Prices in the market changes every day. All right. I don't know, should I put him next to his table or maybe against this wall here? Well, let's start off with against the wall. How about that? So we're gonna buy a whole bunch of tables and stuff. Miles will make it that they have to walk in. Not too close. All right. This is like the other game. Okay, there we go. Stacking. We have to take out the stuff from here. All right. Just like the other games. Gotcha. And your workbook. The sales. All right. Put that down over there in a second. You're asking for a lot right now. Okay, so press F. We can place down some products over here. We have to actually place some. All right, cool. Let's make that nice and quick. Some potatoes. Can't go wrong with potatoes, man. I love my potatoes. Mm -mm -mm. Mashed potatoes are great. Airy potatoes are good. Oh, someone just... Okay, I think someone bought something. I don't know. All right, what do we have here? We have a loaf of bread. Okay. We'll put that here. Leave some room in case. I guess it's easier if I pick this up, right? And just bring it right here. Then I have to go back and forth. So yeah, we have uh, we have to go and buy and sell products throughout. I'm not sure uh, where we buy our products from. Usually it's another kind of trader's area for traders to go to. We'll leave that loaf right on the edge. Because living on the edge. Sounds awesome. All right, what else do we have here? Okay, we got another box. What vegetables or fruits do we have? To, oh, we don't have that. That's a tools, all right, cool. Cycle, sickle, sickle. Yes, I know how to say it. All right, there you go. Put it over here. <laughs> Put it over there. Sounds like a plan. Boys, take up a freak load of room, dudes. Does it tell you how much this stuff is? Can we manage how much money, how much we're selling these for? I don't think it does. No, it just gives me a grab feature. Does it give you F or anything to do anything? I see there's a little gear there, but I don't know how to get to that. But anyways, it's all good. All right, they want me to put down my notebook too. I think that was in Q workbook. And we'll place that down here. It's a ledger, I guess. Okay. And they want to verify that. So we can sell it too if we want to. We obviously don't want to sell it. We're going to interact with it. All right, complaints. No shovels, no bread, long bread, no cord. Oh, people are picky. We sold four potatoes so far. We made total sales of seven buckaroos, which I believe we grabbed from here. 17 buckaroos. All right. There we go. You buy anything? You need some of our, our wonderful hovering stuff? 20 bucks. You must. That must be the much they, they just bought. Did they just buy that? Yep. 15 buckaroos for that. Bread is three bucks and potatoes are four. I don't know. Can we change the prices? Hmm. Anyways, we'll save up right now. Workers at shop 7 a.m. Workers close shop when out of stock. Gotcha. 
All right, so I, I'm I'm guessing we're going to, have to go buy more, right? And right now we have seventy six dollars on top. How y'all doing? Everybody good? Why don't you come buy some stuff? Buy some stuff from me, why, buddy, man? The first time it was funny. The second time, I'm not I'm not closing my store for you. No, get in there. All right, we have any more stuff? Wait, wait, where were you doing that corner? Oh, we need to put the pooper out too. Look, I've I've urine dirtiness <laughs> and hunger. Okay, I I I guess a bed too. We have a bed. I guess we'll put them in my house. Should I put the uh, pooper in my house too? Whoa! Take your cart to market and to load your goods. All right. Put the pooper around the corner. I mean, that's a proper thing to do, right? Is that the little ledge we have to have it on? Oh, maybe not near the window. <laughs> Let's not do that. It's probably be completely wrong. I'm going to use it. Okay, so yeah, the gear, there's no gear thing. It's just really what it tells you to bomb you to use it for. So yeah, I mean, they, we have plumbing in that thing. That's great. I'm just going to see if how much money we have. It looks like we sold out a lot of potatoes. Where the hell we you know money? Where's my potatoes gone? All right, so I guess we're going to take us 80, 94 buckaroos. I was hoping to get just a tiny bit more cash to bring like $100 over there and be able to buy some stuff. I um, Can you guys go? Wow, you guys walk around with a knife, dude. Did you not be taught how to not walk around with that? That's dangerous, dude. You stab yourself. Can you buy something? Please, thank you. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, what do we have? 16 bucks. All right, good. So what, what do we just run out of? Okay, bread is almost out, and so is potatoes. And people are complaining about long bread and stuff like that. Well, so be it. Where the hell am I going? Oh, my God, the market's so far away. There's something else in between here. I don't know. Can I cut off? Because I don't want to go around that long route. It must be a short cut around here. Yeah, there we go. So my stamina is on that green bar on top where my urine, <laughs> sorry, dirt and hunger is. So I guess we're going to feed ourselves too. Most likely, maybe a vendor out there. Hot dog, hot dog. What is this place? Let's go check this out. I left my cart down there, I think. That doesn't look like very much. Thought maybe we'd find some like specialty stuff. You know, some presents and stuff left behind. Some extra loot. Looks like that's not being done. We're not getting new extra, extra stuff. Am I right way? I think I'm going the right way. I think I am. Well, we got ourselves a little bit of force over here. Pretty cool. And we should be... Yeah, this is much better than taking a long route. <laughs> I think that would have killed us. I'm taking that shortcut even from there. I think I'm going to cut right through. Oh, oh. There's a little stamina issues. Okay, so it's a little bit far away. It doesn't look so bad. It looks pretty, the game. Stamina comes back pretty quick. And it's currently 2 o'clock. We can see on the top left there. Am I at the right place? This doesn't look like the right place, does it? Oh, there's some books and stuffs. Oh! What? Okay, well, why would I want to... Oh, so you can see complaints, shovels and crap. Did I bring my cart? No, I just left my cart right into your freaking furniture. Uh, what do you have here? You have even a... Oh, I need a bath. That's 50 freaking buckaroos, but I need to wash myself because I'm going to be dirty. <clears throat> Should we just go earn money and see if these guys open up in the morning? Because right now we're 110. Let's see what we have to buy ourselves first. Maybe we can be a little bit of a dirty. As long as our guy is selling stuff is good. Auto save is on. All right. All right. So let's see here. Good price. Good price. Good price. That looks like a nice piece. And usually I think when we buy these things, there's multiple amounts of stuff that comes with it. Normal price and some fishies here. We have people mentioning they want a bread, long bread, high price. Well, they're not going to get any of that right now because we're going to stick with low price. It sounds like kids next to me. It's like there's a little party going on. All right. Well, these are all high price. So I think we're going to buy some more of you because that's sold pretty darn well. I don't want to waste. All right. Well, it's nicely packaged. And we can rotate too. All right. I can swear to God, it sounds like a bunch of kids playing in a fountain area. Okay, this is good price, too. This is steak meat. I mean, let's go for steak. How much is that? Normal price, 70. Current price, 67. Ouch. Uh, and I think I can go a little cheap and get as much products as I possibly can. Hope this doesn't go bad. Oh, we can stack them. Hope the product doesn't go bad. That's for sure. All right, we have some veggies, too. 
High price, high price. We need some potatoes. Oh, damn it. Well, not today. We have garlic's good price. Sore onions. And high price for those two. So we'll get these uh, pomegranates. Oh, those are good. Those are good little buggers. My daughter loves those. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'll grab some pomegranates too. Why not? Try to be as cheap as possible. Okay, and I still have some good coin left. And what else we have here? Uh, we have some cooking oil. Okay, anything in tools? Oh, watch out the hammer, dude. Gonna hurt someone with that. Oh, these things are freaking expensive. These are better grade, I guess, than we had. I'm thinking so. It must be lower grade stuff. These are all very expensive things we can't afford right now. We can sell a whole bunch of different stuff. Wow. Seven seeds. We have torches. Bags and stuff. All right. Well, I do need a bath. So, let's see if there's anything else here I can buy. It's a decent price. I guess the onions. Onions are great. I, mean, I love onions. I love me some onions. Onion and some fish, I guess. Why not? Get stack it on those baskets. It's wonderful. Let's just make it like that. Okay, that's a pretty good amount. I have 59 bucks. I think we're in pretty good shape to go and buy ourselves a bath. Unless a guy jacked up the price. Where the hell is this fountain come from? Some kind of stream nearby or something. Uh, what is this? Okay, you can buy more workbooks if you want to. Weird. All right, cool. All right, that just went into my inventory. I thought I had to maybe... Oh, whoa, whoa, no, no. Can I put it back in? Okay, we're going to put it like that. My God, man, my store is rocking. It's like a Black Friday sale at one point there. I saw like five or six people walk out of that place. I must have nothing left in there. At least I got a bath. I'm going to bring this in here. I don't care. Oh, there's nothing to sell. How can we even close the door, dumb nuts? You're supposed to close the door, weren't you? I think so. All right. I think I might need more furniture here very, very shortly. Where did I grab that from? What's in here? All right. Oh, someone just took it. All right. Well, thank you. I won't buy the entire store. We need to find some food to grab that. All right. Some onions. Can I grab this? Oh, someone's taking it. Wow, I have no time to put this stuff down. It was like this in real life. Jesus. Can you imagine? You're like your own little uh, Amazon here. People just walk in and grab. Oh, my God. I'm trying to make a nice pile. Do you guys mind? I know. We, we want to sell it. Oh, wow. I bought extra onions. Okay. Oh, that's good. They were going. I think the pomegranates are more popular. Oh, my God anything else right now seems like they went pretty fast i'd like a little taste of pomegranate with that all right what else did i get here i got some uh flounder the fishies put those on the side here get your fresh fishies okay well this is not easy to put down. Can I put some down here? I can. Anyone want some fish? It's smelly as hell, dude, but it's well worthwhile. This thing takes up a lot more room than it looks, man. Okay, I need to put my bath down, too. I need to Euro go pee. Oh, I got more? Damn it. I think I screwed up when I bought stuff. Hope they, they want fish, because Jesus. I got fish everywhere, dude. I'm so sorry, man. <laughs> the work was like, look at him. What the hell, man? He looks like Booger from the Revenge of Nerds. <laughs> Complete jacked out, dude. All right. Well, I also have a steak with that. They say not to mix those together, but uh, yeah, the steaks will be last. Oh, some bread. I didn't buy a freaking steak, did I? Just bought. I was so sure I bought steak. Oh, well. Failure. I thought fish would be the number one thing today, I guess. Yeah, it's selling. Better than nothing. There you go. Have some bread with your steak. It didn't buy very well. I'm sorry. 
Long bread was very expensive. How much coin did you earn today? 100. Good job there, Booger. It was a name, wasn't it? Booger. What's this guy do over here? Is this the guy we're going to buy food from? He's a vendor? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. So he's selling right across the street from me. We need to give ourselves a little bit of food. So, yeah, there you go. I guess it'll make a difference. We're eating cheese. Hopefully he doesn't have the kind of issues and such. All right. Well. Did I just put the tub on the outside at this point? Wow, that just went really dark in a second. The... It's pitch black. There's not a star in the sky, man. You can see the outlines of the trees. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but it. Okay, um, let's just uh, open this up. Let's get the bath out here. I don't think it makes a difference where you place this thing. I'm gonna put it outside. I don't care if people are watching me. Would you rather I be all nice and clean than smelly and crap? Did my worker just disappear? He did. He didn't even bother closing the friggin' door. What an asshole. All right, well, we're, we look like we got a lot of fishies and stuff, and uh, we got a lot of food. How much we end up with here? Uh, some some okay coins. So let's go and get some sleep, and I'm going to put my bed down. And I think in the morning, we're going to have to go back out. I mean, I think I can sleep in there, too. Man, you never close, dude, eh? These are first ever McDonald's, 24-7, dude. Way to go. What does everybody look like? They came out of Revenge of the Nerds. All right, we're up. I'm hoping to... Okay, got a bunny rabbit jumps now. Jumping, jumping. I'm not sure what he was doing. <laughs> I just gotta love the people of this town. Maybe he can't open up his own freaking doors? You went inside, but you didn't open up. Oh, you, you, did you change your hat? Dude, I, I didn't mean to insult you yesterday. Can you just sell off all this friggin' fish? Mate, how'd you sell with the door closed? I got paid twenty dollars very shortly, so I gotta remember that. I have like two hundred eight buckaroos. Uh, we have ratings and stuff. We should check out and see what that's all about. For a store too, I can see rating on top. Shop rating. All right, current shop rating is zero. That's nice. Measurements and how happy your customers are. We'll play this one. Okay, but if you have the right stuff, I can't sell things. Hey, no complaints so far this morning, I think. Okay. Are they done? All right. Uh, I'll pay you later. Don't worry. Don't steal. I got a much bigger one there. Guess we're going to be able to upgrade. I keep on coming in the wrong way. I feel like I'm going the right way, but it seems like I'm going the wrong way all the time. Oh, well. How you doing, buddy? How much is a friggin' table here? Well, that's a much bigger table. 35 bucks. It's not bad, dude. I mean, this is a pretty decent pricing. Daily worker. There we go. It's now I'm down to 198 bucks. We have shelving, too, we can get. How much are those? 30 bucks. I mean, that probably would be cool. Oh, this is nice right here. Yeah, let's buy one of those. All right, we bought one. Okay, I need to figure out where this water... It's right here. Do you have a water park in that place? I must have a water park in there somewhere. Maybe an underground water park. You guys are not holding your kids down there, do you? It's like your daycare, you're shooting down with a whole bunch of water? Sounds awfully weird, dude. Alright, let's go and see here. This time, I want to buy steak meat, and uh, yeah, this is Pretty good price. So let's see here. Normal price 70, current price is 51. Now let's buy some steak. So each day the prices do change. I want the long bread. Okay, there we go. Nine bucks. We'll buy that. You guys hitting away. I don't know where the hell that guy is. We got blacksmith somewhere around here. Okay, we got that. And do we have anything that's good here? We need some potatoes, yes. Potatoes are good. Little potatoes. Potatoes are always a delicious thing. Good price for tomatoes, too, and they're actually really good. I don't know if this stuff goes bad or not. I mean, at this point, three bucks. I can sell that off. It's actually current price. It's actually not lower, though. 
Okay, onions have gone up. Wow, good. Hopefully our prices in the stores went up too. That's good for us. These are all high. And pumpkins. All right, 50 bucks for a pumpkin. You can pumpkin that. I don't care for that. Uh, these are six bucks. You know what? I'll buy some of that too. All right, we need some kind of tools here. Oh, no. Still expensive. Yikes. Mm. Ah, you know what? Let's go all out. Let's see if we can make some decent money on this. All right, I have 20. Oop, that was really bad placement. There we go. It's not straight. I know it's driving nuts too, but it's all good. And what do we have here? Some cooking oil. All right, let's buy some cooking oil for shites and giggles. Giggles and poops. Auto save. Thank you. I did forget to save too. Excellent. I have uh, 10 bucks. Anything with 10 bucks here? That's not 10 bucks. Nothing here. Sorry if I'm cutting off, dude. I'm busy, busy, busy. And some more bread. Here we go. Can't go wrong with two kinds of breads. I love my bread, so. All right, cool. Okay. Here we are. Here we are again. All right, so now I actually have a shelf I need to put down. Let's get a shelf number two and place that down. Maybe right here where people walk in. Really confuses Shay of them. There we go. Hopefully no one steals anything. I don't think you steal in this area. I believe people will kick your butt for that. All right, I think these are produce, right? This one? Yeah. Okay, so let's start putting the produce here. One small put oh, tomato. Two small tomato. Look at us go. We're tomato kings. So small. Probably should put them on a shelf, but it's all good. I think I put the produce all here. Do we sell all the fish, dude? Really? Yes. Oh, good job, Boogie. Appreciate that. We need the coinage. So might as well make it happen. Maybe we'll put the bread on a shelf. That always looks always nice to have a bread on a shelf and stuff and oil in there. So apples are bigger than the others. Pretty good. Different kinds. And usually produces all these, right? So that's good. Here's another potato for you. You know what? Let's put them all together here. Make some room. Put that over here. We have one pomegranate left. Uno pomegranatos. Those things are so good. Still, like I mentioned, daughter's probably favorite thing is when these things are in season. <laughs> oh my god, it's so expensive. Okay, so we have here some loaf of bread. All right, we can make the bread happen. Let's just rotate that, make some space. Let me grab this again. That. I know I'm so far away. Here she comes again. Best friends, girl. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for taking that, dude. Right, what do we have in here? Oh, some oil. Okay, good. First shelf thing, dude. You almost made me hit that, dude. Don't be careful. Some cooking oil. Nice. Shelves are looking really cool. Don't get a ton of those, do I? Probably a bad place to place them, but it's all good. Okay, we have in here. Oh, we got tools. All right. Yep. Things disappearing. Like, do we have some internet sales or something going on, dude? Some stuff is just disappearing. Are you buying them as we're going? <laughs> making, just making, uh, making uh, sure that you're not stealing this. But uh, I hope there's money showing up in the cash, dude. Just saying. We got a nice little loaf of bread there too. Probably strain these out a tiny bit. Now, if you've done this for a living, I actually uh, worked early on in the stores. I like got placing shelves and stuff. You had no choice. Earned my keep, you know what I'm saying? But it was fun. I mean, didn't have any big problems with it. It's a, it's, it's a long job. I tell you that. It's a, it's a, it's a tough job. It's, it's long days. Lots of work. Go 
There's some steaks out now, so maybe some people would be happy and buy some dough, sell some fish. You know, they had fish yesterday. And I got to look at myself, too. I got to take care of myself by eating and such. So let's try that out. There we go. Woo! Man, you got to spend money to make money, right, buddy? Right. All right, so uh, it's late. How are we doing? That's really good. You did a good job. Oh, you need a higher shop rig. Oh, my God. You stiffed me for this one. Dude, that's just horrible shite. All right, seeds. What else we have here? Candles. Yeah, candles got to be something, right, dude? Long says good price. I'm all good with it. Put that right here. The important thing, I think, is to have different kind of products. This is a good price for a lantern, too. This is a really good price here. All right. Something a little different. Hey, they didn't say I can't sell it. That's a good thing. Bring my little card over here and see if uh, the fish is still in good price. Even. This might go up, so we might grab ourselves a tiny bit. <laughs> fish? Excuse me, people. What is this? Meatballs. Okay. Well, why not? At this point, who might have complained, right? Meatballs. And what do we have here? Some cheese. 72 bucks I have left here. What do we need? Cheaper cheese? Yeah, round cheese is cheaper. I like that. So I can get a bunch of different kind of products in here. Uh, we also have this kind of bread, too. Yeah, that's good. Let's have a bunch of different kind of bread so I don't have people complaining. Bread seems to sell extremely well. Pomegranates have gone too high up for now. We're not going to touch those. And uh, I don't know. The onions went up too. So we're going to hold off a tiny bit. And I guess we'll have some more potatoes. Because like I said, you can't go wrong. Potatoes were good. And I have uh, $77. Do you have anything in here? Cooking oil, olive oil. And these are all high priced. So I guess we're going to get ourselves maybe some of you. Yeah, whatever. I think it was a little bit expensive, but fine. This is all other shelving. All right. I think we're good. Uh, 40 bucks left. 40 bucks, and I can't buy anything from you guys. Yeah, there we go. I wiped myself out clean. Okay, so the only way I can put this down is on something. So it has to be like this? All right, for now, we're going to put it like that. That's very weird. I wasn't able to put any wall. I tried and tried and tried, but I couldn't do it. It's all good. We'll, we'll figure it out afterwards. We'll put another potato in here. What the hell just happened? Are you guys buying stuff? Because it looks like we should be closed right now. Did you pay for that? Did you pay for that? Well, nighttime comes fast and really bad. All right, how much do we have? 373 buckaroos. Yeah, baby. I love seeing that. That's awesome. All right, what do we have here? More potatoes. Let's put those down here. I don't know, should we put something else up there? Maybe some, I don't like those shelves at all. I'm really surprised we can't place them anywhere else. I I went through all the walls, and the only time it worked is when it hit the ground, so I don't know. This is like horrible placement 101, how to, don't place your products, it's fine. All right, we got some cheese. We'll put the cheese on top there, there we go. We have here some special bread. Rotate. Can I not rotate that? Okay. Kind of tough to put the cheese on there. Holy balls. Hopefully people will buy this one and, you know, have a little bit of bread rack over here. We'll put all the bread on this side too with the other stuff. I mean, I'd love when you go to a baker and they have like the bread out in the racks like that. It's so freaking smells so good. Oh, I love fresh bread cooked. Mm. Didn't think much to make me happy. All right. Can we stack these? We can. Excellent. Hopefully the guys pick properly. Get your fancy meatballs. I think I might need more room. Can I jump up on this? Oh, I can. All right, good. Oh, we freaking have lanterns too to sell. Holy balls. I'm going to run out of room. 
you know what I can do is use this place here in front, right? When Booger comes back, he'll be fine. He'll just see old lanterns and stuff. Oh, that's really nice. I'm curious to see if he's going to be dressed up as something else today. Seems like Booger has a whole bunch of clothes. All right. That's a lot of lanterns. Okay. What do we have here? Some oil and stuff. The other oil is sold really nicely. This is good cooking oil. Put it down. Oops. Grab that out. Precariously on the edge. It's always great near the front door. That's a smart move to do. I try and do my best. <laughs> Risk assessment. How to make money 101. All right, we're going to place this one here. All right, what else we have left here? We have quite a bit of stuff. Uh, this is supposed to be produce, so let's see what else we have. Some more meatball things. Just jump on table. Boy, you can't fit much on that. All right, I'll be right on the edge. Can I stack these? I can. Screw it. I'm stacking the meatballs. I'm getting desperate. And we have, oh, some pouches. That's right. Yeah, oh, there's a fancy pouches. Fancy, fancy pouches for all people that want. How much money we can make off this? Probably end up with a pretty good day of coinage there. Uh, we're going to need to eat, like, ASAP. That's why I was happy to see some food in there. I'll put some up here, too. Don't, oh, wait. That could be a bad, bad thing. People can steal by mistake. Oh, do you know your coin is perched, dude? Okay. Grab that. Put those over here. They sold pretty good, though. We sold uh, quite a few. I like that. All right. Put it there. Perfect. Let's just make sure it's all nice. So, uh, yeah, like I said, we're going to sell off uh, the product and see if we can uh, make some good money off this stuff here. Let's see what's left. One more thing. I don't even remember what the hell I bought now. Candles. It's a candle in the wind. Never known. There we go. Would have liked to know you, but I was just a kid. The candle burned out long before Marilyn and Monroe ever did. No, it's not the right lyrics. Be no one's saying. All right. Put that down here. Let's get some sleep and uh, eat and stuff. Store is open. And it's, did I, wait a second, when store is closed, I make money? No, okay, just make sure, make sure. Okay, so I, I need to uh, poop. Oh man, that's a heck of a pee. Good stream, dude, good stream. All right, and uh, we need to eat. And it's two o'clock in the morning, so hopefully people wake up. You, dude, are awesome. Thank you for being here, appreciate it. Thank you for not overcharging. By the way, I'm, I'm selling that cheese a whole lot more expensive. You gotta appreciate these hovering lamps, man. That's pretty impressive. I think someone forgot to put a stick in there or some kind of pole. All right. <laughs> Open up, dude. Did you sell anything when I was got? You know what? The... Very fancy. I definitely. Am I getting a new worker every day? Uh, yeah. If you guys, uh, yeah, if you want, not you, but, uh, you know, they could just open up the door next time. Just, just open up the freaking door. Holy crap, dude. Got crazy hair. Got ribbon hair. There you go. Look at that. They're buying my stuff. They're buying it all. Now we're able to afford a whole lot more stuff. Well, it's a pretty good day. So we're seeing it at least progress. And we can buy more and, of course, continue and build as much as we possibly can. It looks like it's a never-ending story of that. And it was quite a fun. I had a little fun journey there. And again, if you guys want to copy this for free, uh, well, there's a giveaway in Discord. So go and check it out this week there. I'll give it uh, and make sure it's up and running. And yeah, just keep your eye out. Sometime this week, there'll be a nice little giveaway. There's always seems to be games being given away. So if you haven't done so already, go and check it out. We had some nice ones, Icarus, and a whole bunch of them. So again, thank you all for being here. Really appreciate it. If you guys are enjoying seeing brand new games before you buy them, please make sure you like button. If you're brand new, please go and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And thank you for being so amazing. You guys are the best. Don't forget to come and join me on Twitter too. We have a lot of fun too. Thank you very much for everybody who's joining up everywhere. Appreciate all your support. You guys are the best. This game edge, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.